He's the savior of the world And now we can call him friend God sent his son He's the savior of the world And now we can call him friend Son, he's the savior of the world, and now we can call him friend. God sent his son, he's the savior of the world, and now we can call him friend. Jesus said.
letting me have a PJ party tonight. We're going to make Christmas cookies and watch Christmas movies. I'm so excited I put my PJs on early. Can you see what's on them? Alphabet letters. Look, here's the letter A. A is for angel. Oh, and look, here's the letter J. J is for Jesus. What other letters do you see? Oh, look, here's the letter S. It's such a fun letter. S is for silly string. Hoo, hoo. It's Ollie. Hello, Poppy. Hoo, hoo. I love playing with silly string too. Hey, Ollie. I love silly string because it starts with the letter S. Silly string starts with S. It's true. I have another word that starts with an S for you. Listen to this story. Just follow me through. Ooh, ooh. Follow me through. Follow me through. Who? I've got a Bible story for me and you. <gasps> well, hello, everyone. Merry Christmas. I'm Aisha, and welcome to my cupcake food truck. Do you want to see what I've cooked up today? <laughs> these are my S's for Shepherd's Cupcakes. Aren't these little sheep so cute? I made them because today we are hearing the next part of the Christmas story and there are shepherds in it. Are you ready for a story? If you're ready, on the count of three, yell, tell me a story. One, two, three, tell me a story. <laughs> The true story of Christmas happened many years ago when Jesus was born. Now, because Jesus is God's son, you would think that he would be born in a special place like a castle. And there would be a big party with confetti and lots of people there. But is that what happened? Is that where Jesus was born? No! Jesus was born in a stable in the town of Bethlehem. There wasn't a party, but there were some animals and the only people there were Mary and Joseph. Do you think that is the end of the Christmas story? <laughs> no! God wanted everyone to know that his son Jesus had been born. That night, there were shepherds in a field. S is for shepherds. Everyone say, S is for shepherds! S is for shepherds! Now, what do you think a shepherd's job is? They watch over some kind of animal. Do they take care of giraffes? No. Do they take care of frogs? No. What do shepherds watch over? <laughs> sheep. That's right. What sound do sheep make? Ba, ba, yes, good sheep. Wait, look, <gasps> what's happening? It's an angel! An angel appeared in the sky and said to the shepherds, I bring you good news of great joy. Jesus is born! Then suddenly, the whole sky was full of angels who started praising God and saying glory to God in the highest. When the shepherds heard this, they ran to find baby Jesus. When they found him, they were amazed. They wanted everyone to know that Jesus had been born. So they ran and told everyone that God gave us Jesus. And that's how we know God loves us. God gave us Jesus. <laughs> did you like the story? If you did, give it two thumbs up. Two thumbs up. Hey there, Ollie. Tell me, how do we know God loves us? God gave us Jesus. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me. How do we know God loves us? God gave us Jesus. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. See you next time. Bye. So there is your story, and it's all true. The shepherds told everyone about Jesus, 
because Jesus came for everyone. Hoo, hoo. Thanks, Sally. Goodbye to you. Hoo, hoo. Wow, the shepherds were so excited when they saw baby Jesus, they told everyone that God gave us Jesus. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say, got it. Get it? Got it! Good! Now we know a super sensational word that begins with the letter S. Shepherds! It's almost time for my PJ party. I can't wait to be like all the shepherds and tell everyone how God 